We're here at Mobile World Congress 2019, and I've been speaking to Marty about 5G. Customers are coming about asking how they can prepare and beef up their LTE networks. What are you hearing, Marty? So one of the things we're seeing is the solution you need to upgrade to 5G is very dependent on what region of the world you're in, what auctions are coming, different people are adding different frequencies. Uh, if you talk about a T-Mobile, 5G is 600 megahertz. If you talk to an AT&T, it's 28 gigahertz. And so how you approach it really depends on what you're going to do in your own jurisdiction. But the key point is Comscoat has a huge portfolio of solutions for whatever it is you need. We're not trying to rubber stamp a single solution and sell it to everybody. We work with each customer to figure out what will work best for them, and then we put a solution together. So it's about what each customer needs. So how is Comscope helping customers get ready for 5G? Based on some recent news we've had with 3.5 capable antennas, what, do you, what are we doing for them? So for 3.5 gigahertz, we have quite a variety of solutions. So in the U.S., most of 3.5 is at the small cell level. And we've come up with a number of products that are in the small cell space that will support the U.S. CBRS band. And there's one in our display over there. In Europe, 3.5 gigahertz is more of a macro play. So what we've done is we've developed a standalone macro antenna. We've also developed FDD antennas that have the 3.5 gigahertz integrate in that. And I think we're one of the world's leaders in that area. And in addition, we've also created shrouds that allow a pure FDD antenna to be combined with an OEM's massive MIMO 3.5 gigahertz, and it appears as if it's one antenna, and we have one of those over here. Speaking of OEMs and collaborations, I know we just made an announcement with Nokia. Can you tell us a little bit more about uh, what we're doing with them? So we're doing a couple things with them. Uh, besides working on the shroud uh, concept that you see behind me, uh, we've collaborated with them on some FDD massive MIMO products which are being sold commercially in the United States. So it's really exciting to us to see, be involved with massive MIMO at not say a science fair type level, but actual commercial products. And we're now moving forward on our next generation of products with them, uh, looking at the U.S. market, also looking at other markets as well. Fantastic. And I know that we're seeing a lot of our competitors here, and when your customers come by the stand, why work with Comscope versus the competition? So I think a critical factor is we have the entire path. I used to say the entire RF path, but you know, in 5G you have a virtual network and so where say the RF stops and the fiber starts could be different places but the point is we've got the RF products we've got the fiber we've got the power we've got concealment and zoning is very important these days so that all helps and we've got a lot of this on display so basically we can supply everything uh, except normally in the macro the, the radio well, thank you so much, Marty. As, as you can see here, Comscope is helping service providers prepare for 5G. We've got the fiber, we've got the wireless, we've got the connectivity. And thank you so much for your time, Marty. Sure, Justin.